Hi everyone! Welcome to Art with Miss Carlin. Today we are going to be working with the elements of art, kind of reviewing them, um, line, shape, color, and texture. So first we're going to just review them in our sketchbooks or on a scrap piece of paper and then we're going to make a dry drawing that uses line, shape, color, and texture. I'm going to start by folding my page into four sections. I'm going to label my boxes, lines, shapes, colors, and textures. And I'm going to come up with my own lines, shapes, colors, and textures. I started with crosshatch, curvy lines, wavy lines, zigzag lines. You can come up with any lines that you think of. Um, not just the ones I did. Spirals, dashed lines, diagonal, vertical, and horizontal. And there's more that I didn't use. Next, I am thinking about organic shapes. Again, organic shapes are shapes that you find in nature. Here are some examples. Geometric shapes are next, and those tend to be shapes that have uniform measurements, triangles, squares, rectangles, for example. Next is color. And last, I found some Lego, Lego to create texture. My next drawing, I'm gonna come up with whatever I want to using line, shape, color, and texture. Can't wait to see what you come up with. Blue skies, bouncy springs, we just named two awesome things. A Nobel Prize, a piece of string, you know what's awesome? Everything. Dogs and fleas, allergies, a book of Greek antiquities, brand new pants, a very old vest. Awesome items are the best. Trees, frogs, clogs, they're awesome. Rocks, clocks, and socks, they're awesome. Figs, and jigs, and twigs, that's awesome.